Hi everybody, it is Kat here from Irregular Thinking. Um, I've just jumped on to do this video because it has been the big Irregular Choice Halloween collection launch today. Um, as you might know, like Halloween's one of my favourite times of the year. I know a lot of people really, really look forward to this collection. Um, so I really wanted to come on and show you my top six and show you what I loved from the collection and just literally go through it and um, show you all the details in case you're still waiting for your shoes to arrive, in case you just want to have a little look. Um, yeah, so we're just going to go through it all bit by bit. If you've got any questions at all, I'll try my best to answer those. Just pop a comment down below and I will will do my best to answer them. So yeah, six styles, let's crack on. I'm going to start off with the most exciting, um, or in my opinion, most exciting, the most outrageous pair from this year, which is the Ghost Train boots. Look at how fabulous they are. So like full, like quite a high boot this time for regular choice. Um, so yeah, we've got this, we've got the character heel, which is the skull. So these are my absolute favourite pair from the collection. This is like a gorgeous, gorgeous matte pink. And then we've got the two pink eyes there, which will light up. So I'll just show you that. So you've got a press here button at the side, which when you do press, they light up. So you can switch them on and off for when you walk. So one's off and then when it flashes through times, that's them on. So yeah, so when you walk, your lights will flash, which is pretty cool. Um, these are also glow in the dark. So the skull, this pink section behind the train and the actual words of ghost train do actually light up in the dark as well, which is pretty cool. Um, I tried it a little bit last night. It wasn't that bright last night, but I didn't think I'd left them out in the daylight long enough to show it. But I did do a really cool video um, for TikTok and Instagram. So like there's a video of that that'll pop up. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna show you a couple of the details in here. So obviously you've got your ghost train here. You've got all your embroidery along here. You've got a fluffy little ghost, which is absolutely adorable. Then your train with, I really thought this was a really nice touch. So you've got the bones there to go around, to go around the train tracks. And then you've got your back here. So you've got your little skeleton. Obviously, you've got your sticker that shows you where to push the button. You can take that off. I just haven't yet because it's easier for me to find and I'm showing you. And then even little things like that boo. You've got two beautiful fabrics here, which is super gorgeous. And these are so, so nice. Um, I love them. They're my favourite from the collection, I think. Um, so size wise, they're true to size. Um, with regards to your foot length, I take a 39 in these. Um, for me, because of the heat, the length of the boot and the width of the boot, there's no real stretch. There's like a tiny little bit here, like not really. Um, they don't fit over my legs. Like it's not happening. Um, obviously like I've got really fat legs, I've got really chunky calves, like all this sort of stuff, absolutely fine, no bother with that. I just know that these boots aren't gonna work for me. Unfortunately, there isn't really any giving them. Um, I can probably get them up to about here. Um, so yeah, definitely for the more sort of thinner legged others, which is an absolute shame because they are one of my favorites, um, as I keep saying. But yeah, so these are, that's these. Next, we'll move on to uh, the most popular, I think. I think this is what, the one that sold out the quickest, which is the spiderweb boots. So these will remind you of Mealy um, from a couple of years ago with the heart. But instead of the hearts, we've got the gorgeous spiderweb. So this is so much more flexible than Mealy. Um, it's really, really nice. So I'm going to show you that you've got a giant spider at the front. And then you've got your iridescent fabric underneath and a nice mid heel there for you. So you've got those. So yeah, they're beautiful. They're really, really comfy on. Like it's a banjo height heel. It's really like really lovely. Um, and they're just easy, easy to wear. So I tend to tuck these in here when I'm not wearing them just so it keeps the shape a little bit. Um, or I suppose you could use like an elastic band just so it keeps it so it curves around your foot a little bit. But these went crazy. These are definitely a pair that are going to look so much better on the foot than they do me just waving them at you like this. But um, yeah, definitely gorgeous, definitely lovely. I feel like this video is absolutely not doing these justice at all, but they are fabulous. So yeah, got these. Um, then we're going to move on and show you these, another character heel. So these are the Boo Shoe. These are called 
ectoplasmic, I think is the, the one for these. Um, and then, yeah, so you've got cute little ghosties here. There he is. He probably needs a little bit of an eyeing because he's just come out of the box. But yeah, cute little ghosts. So when you walk, they will shake and they will move. Um, you've got ghosts on the front. So these aren't fluffy. These are glitter. You've got a really deep, beautiful, like midnight blue fabric here. And then you've got boo on one shoe. And then on the other shoe, you've got um, which is good. So true to size for these. These were a little bit tight for me, in a like a tiny bit tight for me in a 39, like wouldn't size down. But if you're between sizes, I would size up and not down. Um, these were good for me. And then I'm just going to show you these. So underneath the skeletons, you've got two different patterns. So you've got, underneath the ghost, sorry, you've got two different patterns. You've got the skeletons, which are these here. And then under this one, we've got boo. So these are the first Halloween shoes that we've got that make a noise so press button here right there I'm going to try and show you this so you can hear it so that's them on and then so that's the three different noises that they make hopefully you could hear that on there um yeah which is pretty cool I'm going to try and do a quick video of these with them on as well and then just so you can see them moving when you walk because I think if you're clopping along that's going to look pretty cool isn't it so yeah we've got those next we're going to move on to a bit more of an everyday boot I think and um, these were exclusive to Lottie's Attic and a regular choice so you could only buy them from Lottie's Attic and directly from a regular choice of course these are cobweb Oh, I should know that. I don't know. They're called my boots. But anyway, they're fabulous. So these are got a similar sort of style as like the dinosaur ones that we've had previously. You've got a gorgeous sparkly cobweb and then you've got beautiful, beautiful, beautiful sequins here. You've got a nice fluffy tongue and then you've got some flowers along the top here, which is absolutely gorgeous. So these are actually really, really comfy and they're really soft inside as well. I'll show you that. Um, I say that as sequins make it for me. These are not Halloween shoes, if you ask me. These are all year round shoes. So yeah, I have to show you these. Absolutely love these. Um, so yeah, if you're if you're still on the fence, I'm sure Lottie's Attic still has a couple of these left. So would recommend these ones. Um, so we'll go back to oh, let's get these. So these are one of the teasers that we saw in um in the Irregular Choice teasers. This is the cat boot. So these are two different boots on two different shoes. So I'll show you those. So I'll show you this one first. So the cat theme seems to be quite popular this year. Um, it seems to be the season. It's on all, Space Cat is on all the soles. It's on all the boxes. It's on everything. We've had a gorgeous, gorgeous bag from a regular choice with this little cat guy on it. So yeah, I want to show you this. He's fluffy and he's 3D. I honestly think that's what sold it to me. Um, like the wings kind of, they're not meant to move, but they do have a little bit of movement. You've got the gorgeous moon. This red and this tartan literally makes it for me in real life. Like, look at that as a boot. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Like, I cannot tell you how little the pictures did this justice for me. I would never have bought them if I saw the photos, but they are absolutely stunning. And then, so I'm gonna show you the other shoe. So again, you've still got the same there. And then this side, you've got this like sort of giant coffin thing. But when you open up, look at that. That's pretty cool. I mean, I don't know when you'd ever open it. It's a different party trick, isn't it? But I love these. These were absolutely an unexpected love from me. Like, I wasn't expecting to like them. I wasn't sure about the fit. The fit's always a bit dodgy for me, like, thickness, because it's so straight. But I think they've done such a good job with these. Like, I had to have them. And again, true to size. Went for the 39 on those ones as well. Um, Just all round pretty gorgeous to be honest and then last but not least so I've saved this to last because these were definitely my surprise these were the pair that didn't want them didn't like them wasn't for me um I thought they'd be popular definitely but like I just didn't think that I would love them but the fabric choices in real life are just they just make it for me and that is these moth boots so like, I honestly look at this, to this, to this, to that heel. They, that won it for me. Like in daylight, that is gorgeous. Again, for me, not a Halloween shoe, would wear this all the time. Same sort of heel height as the um, Christmas boots from last year that was super popular. This is such a good 
heel height for all like all the time like you would go out in these like in the daytime like you would go out in these in the nighttime it's just a really small heel it's lovely so if you imagine like kind of banjo height there so if you can see so imagine this is a banjo and that's that um it's got like slight patterning in the heel and it's just lovely so yeah and then you've got your fabric so again this is all stitched on all the way around here and then you pull this side off and that's how you get to your laces so one side comes off with this giant section of velcro and then you've got this bit here that is attached i like people ask me every time like when i show stuff like can i take that off i don't think i like it this is not coming off like you would completely ruin your shoe if you took that off um yeah so it's velcro on that side for me like Again, chubby legs, I have a lot of room in these. Like, it's not like I'm short of Velcro. It's not like it's showing too much. Um, it's done a really, really nice job of these. And then obviously you've got your lovely little laces. And yeah, I just really, really like them. Um, I thought they were such a good, a good all-round boot. So for me, like, obviously they're quite Halloween-y, a lot of them. These I would wear all the time, like all the time. And then I would wear the other ones that are a little bit more like Halloween style. Um, like full Halloween, love. And then obviously you've got your ghosties. Love this. I'll do a walking video in these. And then, I mean, that cat is just killing it for me this year. I love it. I love it. I love it. Love it. But yeah, what did you think? What did you think of the collection? Do you think they did a good job? Um, it was very cute to see this year as a whole. I think. Um, I think a lot of people wanted it to be a bit more like gritty halloween you know like very much like do you know i mean this this is halloween this is a bit cutesy do you know like do you know what i mean i don't know um for me like i like the mix i think as a collection it's a bit of an odd one um i don't necessarily feel like it's a cohesive collection but i feel as like a set of individual shoes it's beautiful like they've done a really good job and these were just my top six of like the ones that i love the most there is definitely like more to the collection that you could see and love and yeah it was just nice we got a different character here in the ghost um which again like on the photos i don't think that did much justice to but i'm hoping that when people see them in real life they'll love them absolutely love those boots that's what the regular choice is about for me and then, yeah, just a little bit of something for everybody. There was flats, there was mids, there was high heels, there was boots, there was shoes, there was everything. And yeah, I just loved it. So yeah, please let me know what you think. Um, and I will be doing more YouTube videos like this for other launches. So if you do like what you see, please subscribe and I will see you soon. Thanks very much for watching.